Good morning, everybody. Happy whatever day it is. What day is it? Happy Wednesday, Thursday for you. I put these on. I don't need glasses. They also have no lenses, but I think they're cute sometimes. So yeah. What's up? How are you? How's life? I have a super cute outfit picked out for Saturday. Um, I'm supposed to be going into the city with Ben, possibly someone else. I don't know. We'll talk about that at a different time. <laughs> and I want to wear a cute outfit because, okay, so Ben is seeing Nicki Minaj on Saturday and he doesn't he like going into the city alone sometimes. So I'm going to go with him for mutual support because I'm a good friend. And so I'm going to go to somewhere by myself or with someone while he's at the concert. And I want to wear something cute because like, you know, night out on the city and everything. But the outfit I have picked out is not for cold weather. I'll show you. It's really cute though. This like overall corduroy dress with this baby tee underneath and this bow in my hair but it might be a little too cold but it looks really cute on me so i don't know anywho that's not that's not important to today i went and got starbucks i drove my dad to the mechanic to pick up our other car so that's all i've done so far nothing crazy i have to eat breakfast now Sorry the lighting was really bad in that spot. Oops. You know, my daily breakfast. First I need to take my vitamins. A little health shot. This one's the So Good So You immunity one. But I really love these from Trader Joe's. These um, pineapple probiotic shots. They're a lot cheaper than these. But I'm just gonna drink this one because I have it. I got my usual. Tall ice shake and espresso, no classic, with oat milk and sugar-free vanilla. So good. So yummy. I hate taking these because they dye my tongue red. But whatever. Mm -hmm. I bought coconut water the other day because I know it has like natural electrolytes in it. But this has a little bit of added sugar. I mean, in eight fluid ounces, it's only one gram of added sugar, which is fine. But I ordered these instead to have after that one. Um, it's just coconut water, no added sugar. So yeah, thought that'd be an interesting fact for you. My happy feels. Do you like coconut water? Yes, I do. Try it. Ah, good. Thank you. It has natural electrolytes in it and stuff. You know? That's all I do. What I kind of need is like co-ops. Oh, I did those. My hands are like killing. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Yeah, I'll just wait. Oh, man. You're not old. You're a little old. I'm gonna make my breakfast now. You guys know the scrambled egg with spinach and cottage cheese and bacon. <laughs> Nothing new. And with my three beverages my water, my coconut water, and my coffee. Oh, that's nice. Making my breakfast. I used to never be the kind of person that could eat the same thing every day, like breakfast-wise, but I can't tell you how many times I've had this egg concoction since my surgery. Like, it's just so easy, and I get protein in, I get my vegetables in, like a lot of spinach, and it's just like the perfect like serving size for me. I don't know. But I'm sure I'll get sick of it eventually, but I used to only have this, but now I've added two slices of bacon, which I guess bacon isn't good to have every day, but I'm just finishing up the pack I have now. I just like it, and it helps me use up my cottage cheese. The spinach is just like, I like to get spinach in the morning. Like, I don't even know what else I would make for breakfast. Besides, like, obviously, it would be some sort of egg concoction because I, I just have to have eggs for breakfast. I don't know. 
What did I even have for breakfast before my surgery? I mean, I would have like avocado toast. That was really good. Oh, I miss having that. Like a big, <laughs> it was not healthy. I thought I was being healthy by having avocado toast, but like I would toast this huge piece of sourdough bread, sometimes too. Do like half of an avocado, a little bit of lemon, salt, pepper, spicy honey, Parmesan cheese, and then like do two over easy eggs on top. That was like so good. Like, what really did I have for breakfast? I don't remember. Like, bagels. I loved bagels. I still do, but I don't really eat them as often. And I can't have a whole bagel. I have, like, a mini bagel. But I... Oh! Obviously, I grew up on Long Island. I love a bacon, egg, and cheese. Boss man, can I get a bacon, egg, and cheese? Schmear poop. I don't know if you guys have seen the poop deli memes, but... Long Island is its own breed of people, I swear. Do I have an accent to you? I feel like I don't. I feel like I don't sound like someone that is from Long Island. Like, I feel like my parents have more of an accent than I do. I feel like I sound very basic. Like, I don't say coffee, I say coffee. And, like, dog. Not dog. And, uh, I don't know. But some people do. It's interesting. I just don't think I ever developed like a strong one and an accent, but I don't know. If you heard me speak, would you know I'm from New York? Like, be honest. Because I want to know. I've never like had someone say like I have a strong New York accent, but I don't know. Some Southern people think they don't have accents, but they're like really strong, so I just let me know. Here's my little brekkie. Oh! I'm gonna go eat this brekkie. Yummy lish. Okay, I'm sitting at my desk right now, but I kind of want your guys' advice. Also, yes, I'm watching Soap Mosca on my TV. Don't mind that. But I've been struggling lately with my thumbnails. I feel like I suck at making thumbnails, and I kind of just want your advice or like opinion. What thumbnails are you more likely to click on like the past like i don't know month or two which thumbnails are your like which video thumbnails it would, it would mean a lot if you could like look and see like which thumbnails you're more likely to click on i don't know like do you like how i've been editing my thumbnails i feel like it's a very boring and very basic but like i don't know how else to edit them like i kind of just take a screenshot from the video and then like put text over it sometimes i'll add like little stickers or whatever but i don't know how else to edit it so i would really appreciate if you gave me some advice on that like what you're more likely to click or if i should like try a different format like i know some people so if mosca in particular does like four screenshots like that and then like just puts days in my day in my life but i feel like when i've done that my videos haven't done as well so then i started like editing my thumbnails like taking a screenshot of some of my video and outlining myself or like an object or something and then putting text over it and giving it a little bit more oomph which was working for a second but now i just feel like it's so boring like there's no consistency as far as like thumbnail correlation to views i don't want to be annoying but i, I genuinely want to know what you think because you guys are the viewers and i want to appeal to you um this isn't about me it's about you and i want you to enjoy my content and the first thing you see of my content is a thumbnail and that whether or not you click it or not so i think it's an important thing but i just haven't mastered it yet i don't know like i feel like it looks like shit like this most recent one i did very lazily in canva i didn't even outline myself let me see if i outline myself if i like it a little better and I always do the thumbnail last. Like that's always the last thing I do. So then it stresses me out because I'm like, oh my God, now I have to edit the thumbnail. And I usually edit it while it's, while the video's uploading. I would really appreciate if you guys let me know because again, I want to like appeal to you. Yeah, no, I don't like that. Like some I like outlined, but that obviously is messy, but I feel like it does make it pop more. So I don't, I don't know. And like doing it daily, like, I'm not going to work super hard on my thumbnails. Like, that's crazy. But I could. I could if that's something, like, you guys want to see, like, better thumbnails. I will do that. I don't know. 
but yeah just a little food for thought still eating my breakfast so that's why i'm watching so these eggs are freezing cold but what else is new i'm always eating cold food because i can't eat fast anymore but just let me know what you think i'll really appreciate it i'm in my playroom now i feel like i've shown you my it's, it, it's i mean i don't have a playroom it used to be my playroom now it's just kind of like a storage room basically but my dad has tasked me with figuring this stuff out I have all my like sweatshirts and stuff in these bins oh, my legs hurt from squats yesterday i also can't shut up today like i don't know every thought i have i'm like i need to turn on the camera and talk to you which i guess is a normal thought when you're like a blogger but ew is that what i am like when you think of me you're like oh heather the vlogger is that that's actually kind of cool actually i don't know why i'm saying no all right throw this out this is ugly i wore this in italy the first time i ever went and like what is it why did i wear this goodbye shove my problems away for another day <laughs> okay that one's good what is all of this whoa whoa what what is this whose is this what? I mean, it's cute. I'd wear it, but it's like overall jeans, but obviously right now it's not going to fit. Maybe in the summer. We'll keep that because that's cute. I'm just going to shove these in the closet. Who's going to know? Who's going to know? Who's in the closet? We just shoved myself in the closet for all those years. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh. Good enough looks a little better <laughs> i'm also proud of myself because something i need to be better at is stop eating when i'm full which obviously fucking duh that's like the whole point of the gastric sleeve surgery but i don't know why i just like get so anxious that like oh my god i counted out the protein and all of this i need to eat it all so i get all my protein but i was eating my breakfast i finished my two slices of bacon and then i ate like half the egg and i was like you know what I'm not going to finish this. I'm just going to estimate how much protein I had. I'm full. And I stopped eating. Like that itself is a win. But anyways, this fell off my window. And so did this. So I'm going to fix it now. Okay. Ring-a-ling-a-ling. -a and I think a thumbtack fell in my bed. So that's fun. I can't find it, but... You know, that'll just be a little surprise for later. Okay. Perfect. I'm like sweating. Oh, I'm gonna strip. No, I'm just kidding. I have a shirt under this. Why am I hot? Because I'm fucking fat. That's why. I'm gonna make my bed now. I just thought you'd like to know. I love it, 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 I love it. Camila Cabello's new song. I have stuck in my head. It's like so bad. Ben, if you're watching, sorry, he loves Camila Cabello and he like told me to listen to it and he was like, it's so bad, it's good. And like, I didn't believe him. I was like, this song sucks shit. But then I'm like, I love it, 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 I love it. Like I can't get it out. So Ben, you were right. You were right, okay? You were right. It's like catchy, but in a horrible way. What else can I talk about? Talk your ear off about okay do you guys actually like when i'm like super chatty or do you just like seeing what i'm doing i'm really trying to cater my content to you okay because i care but like do you like when i'm super chatty do you like when i just show you what i'm doing and talk a little bit like what do you like Ugh. i don't like the comforter on my bed it's not even a comforter it's just like this duvet cover but i don't have a duvet and it's taylor swift and I got it for Christmas from my mom. So, like, I have to use it because she got it for me. And, like, I don't hate it, but I want my bed to be more, like, cottage core vibes. And I don't know what color I would pick for that. And, like, the decorative throw pillows or whatever. It's fine for now. I just feel like my bed looks so childish. Like, when you walk in my room, it doesn't look like a 23-year-old girl lives here. It looks like a 12 year old does with all my Taylor Swift merch <laughs> and my Squishmallows. It's fine, totally fine. My book was sitting in my bed. Where'd it go? 
I want you to meet all my stuffies. So this is my peanut butter Squishmallow. I don't remember his name and I don't think I named him. This is another Squishmallow. Don't remember her name either. Got her on my 22nd birthday. This is Java the sea lion. Sea lions are my favorite animal. Got another little sea lion here my parents brought me from Florida. His name is Meyer. This is my fat seal squishy pillow that I got at a secret Santa when I worked at Starbucks. So his name is Starry. This is Bingo. I've had him since I was like four and I sleep with him every night. This is my stomach pillow. I think my mom got me for surgery or like right after surgery, something like that, or Christmas, I don't know. His name is Huntley. And this is a Build-A-Bear that I made a couple years ago. Um, and her name is Bunny Eilish. And those are all my stuffies on my bed. So now you're acquainted with them. I forgot Malcolm. This I got the other day, which you saw. Malcolm the mushroom. Also found my book. It was wedged all the way underneath there, so. I found it. I'm on chapter eight, page 80. It's good, it's going good. I finally met the two main characters, so. I'm gonna go read on my couch. Ugh, I'm just like such a reader, guys. I'm just like so. <laughs> I'm just like so quirky guys like look at me with my little coffee and my book and my book shirt and my slippers I'm just like Dink. my glasses anyhow sorry for this never let me have caffeine again okay you're a met your movie yeah <laughs> just editing this video now I would close out the video on my camera but I just get into such a habit of like when I'm done filming for the day like I'm like I'm done I just also biscuit is in here so if you hear jingling that's what that is um when I'm done filming I literally just plug in my camera and put it in the kitchen and I'm too lazy to go get it right now because I'm editing so I'm just gonna end it on here literally what you saw is what I did for the rest of the night I read some of my book and edited so didn't miss much so yeah um thank you so much for watching as always i love you guys so much thank you for being a part of my life it means a lot to me and you guys are like my family and my friends so yeah thank you for watching please like and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you tomorrow bye